Imagine you walked on the pitch and you see Sam Burgess in front of you. What's the first thing you're going to think? Oh, shit. Coming into a professional game at Bradford, nobody knew who he was. That was all going to change. People called him the enforcer. Just watch the clips on the screen and you'll pretty easily figure out why. He was known for how strong he could run the ball in, but everyone knew him mainly for his big right shoulder. After a couple of years at Bradford and a massive shot on Fufu Fu Moi Moi, he ended up going to rabbit holes over in NRL. And if you're watching this video, you should know what sort of player he was. Hard hitting, hard running, and he's the last person you wanted to run straight at. One of the things he's most remembered by is the way he broke his cheekbone in the first tackle of the 2014 NRL Grand Final. Head collision with James Graham in the very first run of the game, which he then continued to play 80 minutes. Absolutely incredible. That grand final victory for the Rabbitohs in 2014 was the first one for the club in 43 years. Sam Burgess even got the Man of the Match award. In a shock move in 2014, he actually ended up going over to Rugby Union, which didn't end up going too well for him. He ended up signing for Bath, and then he played in the Rugby World Cup for England, and let's be honest, the league is his sport. It was a big mistake for him to go over to Union, but I think he just saw the money like everyone else would. Then Slam and Sam did what we all hoped he'd do, came back to the NRL, joined back for the South Sydney Rabbit Hood for three years until he unfortunately had to medically retire from the game due to his shoulder. His shoulder was absolutely shot, and let's be honest, seeing from all the tackles and all the big shoulder charges he put in, it's pretty obvious why.